for staying with us. There are new plans and new attacks on the table tonight in the race for governor. This as candidates are making stops all across the state. Political reporter Jess Garp with the latest from their events today. Jess? Well, yeah, the general election may have just started, but these candidates know each other well, and already both sides are preparing for the issues that will likely dominate this campaign for the next 82 days. Today, I want to talk to you in, in detail uh, for a few minutes about our new plan for the next four years. We call it Keep Wisconsin Working for Generations to Come. On Alaska, the first stop of the day for Governor Scott Walker as he announced plans at manufacturers. Hi, I'm Scott Walker. Wisconsin's on a roll. And on television. Those plans offering tax credits to families for child care, $5,000 in credits for recent graduates who stay in the state, and start a new middle school apprenticeship program, all as part of a new general election platform. Tony Evers embraces policies that got the state into trouble in the past. That would be a giant step backwards. We've got a plan to keep moving the state forward. He can try to label me anything he wants. I've got all sorts of labels for him if, I, if you want me to share them with you. <laughs> Evers spending the day meeting with and introducing his lieutenant governor candidate Mandela Barnes, having their first long meeting to date over eggs at Mickey's Dairy Bar. It's really exciting to be running with Tony. It's exciting about the prospects of bringing opportunity back to Wisconsin. Evers also having to go on the defensive about his tenure as state superintendent after an ad run by the Republican Party of Wisconsin about how he handled the license of a Middleton teacher. A teacher viewed and shared pornographic material at school. Tony Evers knew about it. Do you believe that those attacks are going to continue and do you intend to fight back on the airwaves in a negative way as well? Yeah, we'll fight back, but honestly, guys, we're not we're not surprised by that. That's that's been always been Walker's MO. It's attack, it's divide and conquer. That doesn't work anymore. We will answer every ad that he has with with uh, with the appropriate response. And as for Governor Walker's new plans, Evers says he'll have an answer for that too. Whatever he's proposing right now pales as compared to what he has, he has uh, the destruction he's done for the people of Wisconsin thus far. Now, both of these candidates made stops across the state today and have plans to do the same in the coming days. They've also agreed to debate, likely the first one held on October 5th in Madison. It's going to be an interesting race. Jessica Arp in the News Center. Jessica, thank you. A big endorsement.